Hey, what's going on guys? My name is Brandon for VPN FTW and today we're going to be taking a look at a little bit of a different service and this service is called MyIPHide.com. Now we normally wouldn't take a look at a service like this but a uh, subscriber went ahead and requested that we take a look at this service so we're going to go ahead pop open the website and take a look and see what it's all about. So just to start off, the, the reason that we wouldn't normally take a look at a service like this is because this is only an encrypted proxy. Now the site does note that this is just an encrypted proxy. They're not trying to treat it like a VPN. They're not trying to, you know, go ahead and take privacy very, very seriously. And another thing is in the in their privacy policy, they actually note that they do keep logs. So this service is really not oriented around privacy. Or I mean, it's not really oriented around. E I don't, I don't want to say privacy because you know you can't hide your IP and it tells that it can still can encrypt your traffic. I just want to note that you know it's not based around privacy. Like they don't want you to you know torrent on it. You know P2P and torrents is banned on it. And you know they do keep logs and they just kind of note that right out of the box. So this right here is not really a privacy oriented VPN. It's more based kind of just like for streaming. And as you guys can see right here, you know, kind of unblock sites and see what's going on. So I just wanted to go ahead and note that right out of the box. So going ahead and taking a look right at the site, myiphide.com. It looks like it notes that it's a lightning fast encrypted proxy. So it looks like you can hide your IP and unblock sites. Now it looks like they support Windows, Mac OS X, and Android. Now it does not look like they support iOS right now, so you can't use it on your um, iOS mobile phone, it appears. So according to their website, you guys will still get encrypted traffic with this, um, this proxy. Now most proxies don't even offer um, encryption, most are just hiding your IP, so that's good. Looks like hide, or my IP hide is offering encrypted traffic. It says they have ultra fast stable connections, hide your IP to, to protect your online privacy. So it looks like they're really advertising this to go ahead and stream and unblock sites if you're maybe in somewhere, if you're maybe somewhere like a university, you know, where a lot of websites are blocked. So it looks like it says our servers are all around the world. We have 55 servers in 23 countries. It looks like these countries span the United States, the UK, Switzerland, Sweden. It looks like all these countries right here. So you guys can go ahead and take a look at those. And it says, unlike other companies, we focus on the speed of our servers instead of the number of servers. So that's pretty cool. It looks like they're saying basically all their servers are optimized. Um, they go ahead and they only have 55 servers now that may seem like a little bit but if like they said if they're high quality servers and that may make the difference now we're going to go ahead and take a look at the price in just a second now it says all package plans include unlimited data transfer unlimited ip switches and unlimited speed it's much faster than vpn uh, so it looks like they're offering that my ip hide is much faster than a vpn um, now it may be faster, but it's not more secure. <laughs> it says uh, one account is good for multiple devices. So this supports Windows, Mac, and Android. Looks like it supports all browsers. So you can go ahead and easily add this proxy right into Chrome, Firefox, IE, or Safari. And it says pay exactly what you need. Don't pay for thousands of server switches that you will never use. We carefully choose our server, our locations and set up servers. So it looks like basically they're saying that all their servers are premium. Uh, they have some testimonials down here. We're not even going to read those. Uh, and it looks like they don't really have much information down here other than um, the company that runs it. Now that's one thing that I wanted to take a look at. One thing that shocked me because I went ahead and took a took a look at this site before we went ahead and came over here. And one thing that surprised me is that the company that is behind this website, Didsoft, actually owns a number of successful websites. So they also offer or they also offer and host my proxy. FindIP.net, Free Proxy List, My IP Hide, Elite Proxy Switcher. Um, so this right here is a real company that we're dealing with. This isn't just you know your run-of-the-mill VPN service. A real company, Didsoft, that was founded in 2005, uh, is going ahead and running this service. So let's go ahead and head back up here to the uh, the prices. So it looks like if you guys want to go ahead and start off with the bear one month, it's going to charge you eight dollars and fifty-two cents. Looks like with three months, it's going to charge you seven dollars and seventy-five cents. Looks like for six months, it's going to run you six ninety-eight. Um, again, that's going to be twenty-three bucks for the three months. That's going to be about forty-two dollars for the six months, and it's about sixty-eight dollars for twelve months. So this does run a little bit more on the expensive side for, uh, and I mean, again, this is a proxy, not a VPN, so it's really not going to protect you the same way. But uh, let's go ahead and move on anyway. Looks like it's going to take us to their main website, didsoft.com. Uh, we're going to go ahead and pay for uh, the one month service. Choose your payment method. Let's go ahead and go with PayPal. Um, now that's nice. Now you guys can now we can either go ahead and do a subscription. So that means that they'll go ahead and bill us monthly. And that way the VPN will go ahead and be automatically billed. And that way we, we won't have to go ahead and keep paying for it. Or we can just do the one time because we're just going to go ahead and check it out for this um, one day. So it says, please put the uh, the uh, email for your hide my IP address. All right. 
We're gonna go ahead and add our account info right here. Order now, we are processing your order, please wait. Now it looks like it's gonna go ahead and redirect us to PayPal. All right, so we went ahead and paid. It says, thank you very much for your purchase of the one month. Please log into the client area you just bought. The password will be sent to your email address within three minutes. Please check the spam box too. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and open up their customer panel right here and check our password. All right, they emailed us a very tiny and low quality password that we're definitely gonna go ahead and change in just a couple of seconds. All right guys, so it looks like right here it has our name, that is your first and last name. Looks like it has your country, the email, my IP services, months one plan, purchase date. All right, so it looks like this will go ahead and expire uh, one month or I guess 30 days ahead. So it looks like we can go ahead and get it for Android, for Mac or for Windows. So we're gonna go ahead and download it from download.com. All right, so they went ahead and sent us to download.com, which is absolutely just rid with spyware and malware. Um, it's seen it's just completely garbage site. I don't know why they would upload their software there. Um, so we're gonna go ahead, upload or download this. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and click next. I wanted to go ahead and close our recorder. I don't know why. I went ahead and scanned this file on virus total because I didn't trust it very much. And one of them came up. Um, it did come up as a virus now. I mean virus total does have false positives and only one actually came up with it So let's go ahead If we can see the main window it looks like we actually got to log in again now I can already tell you guys that I'm just I'm not really a big fan of the service as it is right now I'm um, just the way that your kind of personal information is out there and that they well I mean I guess I guess privacy is not the main thing here like I said success the service is activated to your IP Expiration. Now we will test those IP addresses to find the fastest one. Clicking OK. It looks like a bunch of servers are just going all over the place. It looks like... Would you like to use this IP? Yes. So it looks like it shows our real IP address right here. You are using an encrypted connection now. So um, does this thing have any kind of options? Um, change settings. Let's go over here about hide my IP, miscellaneous, um, close button, double click the system tray. So it looks like we have a free proxy. I mean, I guess that's that's pretty cool. Um, account, account again, renew, log out, general, English, start, hide my IP with the system. So it looks like there are no additional security systems at our security settings at all. So let's go ahead and do our average IP test. We're gonna go ahead and head over to xmyip.com. While that loads, we'll head over to hoover.net. And then in the meantime, we're gonna head over to DNS leak test. Now, sorry, I'm blasting you guys with all these. We just wanna get them done quickly. So it looks like we are appearing in, I guess, Buffalo, New York. That's not Los Angeles. Um, so it looks like we are appearing again in Buffalo. And guys, moving on down here, it looks like our IP address is leaking. So what this website will do is go ahead and run JavaScript, Flash, ActiveX, WebRTC within your browser, and it'll go ahead and let you know if the VPN is truly protecting your whole system. And guys, right out of the box, hide my IP is not protecting our whole system. That is our IP address right there. So it looks like it is leaking, and we're gonna go ahead and head over to DNS leak test. We're gonna go ahead and run an extended test. And it looks like it is finding quite a bit of DNS servers here, but moving uh, back here, guys, like I said, it looks like our what, or it looks like our IP address is leaking right out of the box. And um, I mean, right out of the box is the only thing you're gonna get with this VPN client. But let's go ahead, head back to DNS leak test. And it looks like um, all the DNS queries are appearing from Google. So if you guys wanna know what a DNS leak is, this is why you guys don't want a DNS leak. So basically all your DNS queries will now be going to Google and I mean, I'm not a big fan of that because you know Google's not very into privacy. It looks like it's not really built to protect you or to really secure you. It looks like it's kind of just made to mask your IP. They say it will encrypt your traffic, but seeing as our IP address is leaking right out of the box and um, that they're not a big, you know, they're not big into privacy, that's one thing that we're not a big fan of. So, would we recommend myiphide.com? Um, personally, just right out of the box, no, we would not. We're not a big fan of the client. We're not a big fan that it doesn't really have any settings. We're not a big fan that, you know, your IP is just out there. Doesn't seem like it's for us, but that right there was the first look at myiphide.com. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys did, please give it a thumbs up and be sure to go ahead and subscribe to VPN FTW for more VPN videos just like this. If you guys wanna see any specific VPN reviews or comparisons, go ahead and let us know down in the comments below. But I hope you guys are all out there staying secure.